Hello, everyone. My name is Sammy Fryer, licensed realtor in the state of South Carolina, servicing the PD and the Grand Strand area. And today, for those of you that are looking to move into the Florence area, I want to take a couple minutes and talk to you about Florence Regional Airport and the reason why this is a really important subject to our lives. A lot of you that are considering moving to the state of South Carolina, perhaps our area in Florence in particular, are going to have to consider flight options and availability of flight options for family and or business. And the Florence Regional Airport definitely has some things that you're going to want to consider if you're going to be in this area. So let's take a couple of minutes and take a little short dive into this information. So the Florence Regional Airport is out on East Palmetto going out towards Francis Marion University and starting on August 7th. So in just about a week, American Airlines will be adding a flight to fly to Charlotte three times a day. So the plan is for them to have an early morning, a midday, and a late afternoon flight that would typically serve as a connection for you unless you happen to be flying to Charlotte. Now, flyflow.us is the website for the Florence Regional Airport. I do have it linked down in the description of this video. You can also see some images from the website on your screen. And so I do encourage you to check out the airport's website so that you can obtain any other information that you may want to know about Florence Regional Airport. But what I wanted to do specifically in this video is what I like to do a lot of times is make things practical. I'm a very practical guy. And the fact is, if you're going to be flying, there are some things that you're going to want to consider if you're living in Florence, Darlington, anywhere right here in the Florence area. So on your screen is some flight booking information that I pulled up. As a general example, this would be a flight from Florence to Boston. A lot of times, if you're going to fly from Florence anywhere, you're going to consider three options. You're either going to fly from Florence, you're going to drive up to Charlotte, or you're going to drive to Myrtle Beach and fly. Now, the drive from Florence to Charlotte is a little bit longer than the drive from Florence to Myrtle Beach. You can be in Myrtle Beach in about an hour and a half. So let's just look at an example using those two airports in this scenario. And as you can see, it's just going to be a little bit more expensive to fly from Florence to Boston with that connection in Charlotte. This is not counting any fees from Spirit Airlines or American Airlines on this flight. So you can see the round trip difference, very similar pricing, a little bit more expensive to fly out of Florence. Let's just say you'll be paying for the convenience of not having to drive the hour and a half to Myrtle Beach. However, you do have a connecting flight and a layover in Charlotte. And so the travel time doubles, and that's if there are no delays, of course. The flight on Spirit Airlines from Myrtle Beach to Boston, and yes, for the sake of brevity on this video and just being economical, these are the only two airlines and options that we looked at. Those would be the most comparable. For $211, it's a straight shot, half of the travel time. You don't have to worry about any connections or delays potentially, but you do have to make the hour and a half drive. And unless somebody's dropping you off, you're going to pay for parking. So I would say that it really comes down to a matter of priorities. Getting in and out of the Florence Regional Airport is pretty simple. It's a very small airport and there's not a lot of traffic going through. Then you're probably going to want to take this option going to Boston because of the convenience. You don't have to make the drive. If you don't mind a little bit more travel time, then this may be the option to go. However, if you want to save a couple dollars and just have one straight shot, then you'll make the drive down to Myrtle Beach. So I just wanted to point out that this option exists for those of you that are shopping our area. And these are the types of videos, and the type of content that you're looking for. This is practical, everyday living things that you're going to experience in our area. And I thought this would be helpful information for a lot of you. And I do speak to a lot of you these days from around the country that are interested in moving to our area here in Florence. So I do hope you find this helpful. And to recap, the Florence Regional Airport has service from American Airlines that flies directly to Charlotte to connect you to wherever else it is that you may need to go, flying out three times a day, early morning, midday, and early evening, late afternoon. The pricing for that can be, as you see is in this example, very comparable to making the drive down to Myrtle Beach. So again, this is the kind of thing that would be on a case-to-case -case basis. You're going to have to look at the options and see what makes the most sense for you. I just wanted you, the audience, to know and future Florence residents to understand that you do have legitimate service and options to fly out of the Florence Regional Airport. Again, their website is linked down in the description of this video. If you found this video helpful and insightful, please give it a like. That helps us out a lot. It lets YouTube know that we are putting out content that is actually bringing about value to the audience or the community, and we really appreciate that. And with that being said, if you are considering moving to our area, I am a licensed realtor in the state of South Carolina. If there's anything that I could do to help you out to make your next move, please feel free to give me a call or an email. My contact information is also down in the description of this video. And with that being said, I look forward to hearing from you. Y'all take care, and we'll see you on the next video.